Hi everyone, my name is Hinnang. Today we are going to discuss about sustainable agriculture. So, actually sustainable agriculture is the production of the food, the plant, then the animal products by using the farming technique that use that will help the environment, will protect the environment and also the public health at the same moment, at the same time. So why is it the sustainable agriculture so important this now today and also why is it being promoted? Because of because the sustainable agriculture provides a solution for the food supply problem as the increase of the world population. Yeah. So usually sustainable agriculture will split into the three dimensions, but we don't consider them three but one because focusing one or two dimensions we are not giving you the desired result. So there the three dimensions will be the environment and also the social and the economic. So for the first one, environmental but environment dimension. So by study the biodiversity, so the issue like the water scarcity and also the soil and also the soil erosion will be solved. Yeah. So we also focus on the social social dimension. We focus on the health of the community and also the food quali quality and also the labor's right. Mm. Yeah. So by ensure the food quality, we will protect the health of the community as well. And for the third one, the economic, we will help the economy to generate the farm profit. Yeah, that's it. That's the three dimension of the sustainable agriculture we will focus on. So sustainable agriculture is usually being promoted and support by the rich people. So, so the normal people, <laughs> the teenagers like us, cannot do much effort on it. But there are some ways also. For the for like this one, the farmers market. So by like the Saturday we go to the Pasar Malam, the Pasar Pagi also. By having the conversation with them, we can gain the knowledge and also the gain the knowledge so we can know where's the food, but where's the food come from and how is it made from. So we have the knowledge can gain from the farmer and we also can support them as well as buying their food. Also the second one, the Midless Monday. Midless Monday is what because of the meat is now considered as the one of the biggest pollutant as for the agriculture. So by eating the less meat, so the kilo of the animals will reduce. Yeah. And the pollutant pollution will be reduced at the same moment. So, so the third one will be the buying the organic foods. So sustainable agriculture will produce the organic foods. So like supporting them, it will encourage them to have a continued business and they will have the willing to and also the also the ability to continue their business and sell the product the sustainable agriculture organic product for the people like us. And the third one will be the sharing of information. Sharing information with the others will help you to do and generate the idea for support the sustainable agriculture at the same time. And the third and the fourth, fifth one will be the cook a meal. So after when you're cooking your meals after you prepare you will be more understanding about the foods and that's what you will gain in the process. So my name is Hina. Mm. Taylor's University student. Thank you for listening and goodbye.